Hi guys, this is how to turn off the magnetic timeline in Final Cut Pro X. So how do you know it's in magnetic timeline mode? Well, you have your clips like this and we drag them and you see everything sticks together and it pulls in like this. You don't always want that. You don't want your timeline all moving for various reasons. Sometimes you just don't want that to happen. And how do we turn it off that feature so it doesn't do that when you provide those actions with the clips? What you can do, you can press P to go in the position tool or you can go to this here and go to position. And when that's clicked and when you're in P mode, you go to clips and you drag, it leaves a blank gap there. So you can drag away. You know where you've moved it from. If you want to put it back, you can do that just like that. Or you can adjust the black space as well to your liking. Grab the edges and do that. Or you might want to delete it. If you delete it like that, it's deleted the top clip as well. You don't always want that. So maybe uh, hold the, uh, if you hold the tilde key, then delete. Then see, it deletes the black clip, but not the top bit, okay? But you've got to hold the tilde key as well as delete. Because if you delete this clip, just with a delete key, it deletes the top clip. You don't want that. You know, you're going to lose all your footage, you don't lose your clips. So yeah, and that's uh, basically how you disable the monitor timeline. And if you want to put it back again, all you do is go to A, press A on the keyboard, or you go to here again and go into a mode. If you like the magnetic timeline by default most of the time, like I do, I always keep it in A by default. So I hope that helps you and thanks for watching once again. Peace.